Kill me, I'm here! Kill me! Hi there, this is Matthew Movies coming at you with my review of The Girl with All the Gifts, the 2016 British horror zombie movie that I knew nothing about until a follower of mine recently pointed out to me that I should check it out, and I really, really enjoyed it. Uh, for those of you who are like me and didn't know what this movie is about, the basic synopsis is that this is in a post-zombie apocalypse world where the survivors are trying to uh, experiment with some kids who were infected with the disease in the womb, so they don't present in the tip typical manner of a zombie where they're mindless and all that thing. They actually are aware of the world, they're intelligent, they're intelligible, uh, but they still have all of the uh, people-eating desires. So what they do is they kind of uh, imprison them and they, but they, they try to treat them as humanely as possible, but basically they're using them at, for experimental fodder in order to try to come up with some kind of vaccine. And then the movie kind of goes from there where they're uh, the, the basic crux of the film gets started once a zombie horde kind of takes over the uh, the prison camp and then there's a, just a group of survivors and one of the children that kind of travel through the countryside and it, it goes from there. Uh, I quite, quite enjoyed this movie. I'm really surprised I had heard nothing about it. I mean, there's some pretty uh, pretty big names in it. Uh, Glenn Close is in it. Uh, Gemma Archerton, who is actually an actress who I'm actually a fan of in certain movies. She's been in a lot of really mediocre movies, but there's something about her, I mean, let's be honest, she's hot as hell, but I don't think that that's it. Uh, there's just something about her that I, I find uh, compelling on film. Uh, I think she's got uh, interesting delivery, and I just wish she had more roles of substance. Like, I do, th I think she had in this one. And then she portrayed her character quite well. Uh, Glenn Close basically plays a, a, a doctor who uh, is the one who's, who's in charge of the experimentation and uh, is, spends the entire movie trying to distance herself from the child because, you know, she presents like a, a, any child like you or I, but uh, Glenn Close is using her as like basically lab rats, so she tries to uh, keep her at a distance. And the rest of the movie, like, it's the, the, the child trying to kind of break down some of those barriers. Uh, and, you know, it's it's just a very interesting movie. They they do a lot. Uh, they they change up the the whole concept of zombies in in a few interesting ways, like the whole aforementioned uh, zombie babies turning into uh, intelligent kids thing. But also like the way in which they kind of act uh, is a little bit unique. Like they they like in other movies they do they do tend to kind of. Uh, coalesce but the way in which you can kind of go in between them is is a little bit different than what you see in a lot of different movies um and you know it's definitely got a, an interesting and unique take on the genre uh you know it, it seems like a bit of a hodgepodge of uh, uh, the plots of some of the classics where they're trying to find a way to overcome the scourge while also uh there's the characters that just think that they need to uh, just blow them all up and you know the 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 um the difference between the two the two ideas and how they they kind of co coexist with one another and you know um, it's just a really really fantastically well made film uh, I wouldn't put it at quite as high as uh, the movie Train to Busan which I watched which is by far my my favorite uh, recent zombie movie that I've seen but it, I think it's definitely up there as one of the one of the most interesting entries into the zombies genre in a long time and definitely worth a watch especially if you're like me a zombie movie devotee uh, this is definitely a movie that is must see viewing for anybody else who uh, feels as passionately about the, these movies as I do uh, so those are my thoughts on the girl with all the gifts let me know in the comments below if you've seen the movie if you've heard of the movie uh, if you're a zombie movie fan if you have checked out the movie uh, you know just anything that you, you want to let me know uh, please hit that like button it does awesome things for my channel and please please Please, please hit that subscribe button if you're new to my channel and that notification bell so that you can find out when I put up new stuff. And other than that, have yourself a nice day.